if you guys love Nike SBs and you guys follow them like through all the drops that they have, you guys will know that they're pretty much hard to get. So I was actually able to pick up three in two days at my local shoe shop. So shout out to Home Base. I won those raffles for a size 11 and a half for three Nike SBs. We're gonna be actually talking about only this one right now in today's video. This right here is very special. This is the Nike SB Gundam in the navy colorway. did not release on sneakers yet i don't know if they are going to though because the white colorway came out and i was under the impression that the white colorway was more rare at my skate shop they only had one pair per size of the white but they had two pairs of these navy ones so i was actually lucky enough to get picked for one so without further ado man let's just get straight into this review because this sneaker right now is literally gonna blow his mind because no sneaker no jordan no nothing man has ever done this which is pretty dope so let's get into it all right guys so here's a close-up on the size tag nike sb high pro quick strike thunder blue metal metallic gold retailing for 110 that's my winning ticket come on man let's get this open already i know you guys are dying to see these and i already exposed them a little bit probably the nike sb of the year in terms of creativity and everything don't mind that this is just my ticket but this shoe is just incredible you guys can remove the swoosh as you guys just saw there all right so as always we're going to start off with the outsole of this nike sb pro we have the nike sb branding on the middle there of the outsole in bronze very nice standard outsole for the nike sbs then you go to your, to your midsole and you have this jet black midsole with this bronze stitching giving it a nice contrast and matching up with the underneath layer of this sneaker around the toe box you guys can see the main colors of this sneaker is a navy and black you also have the hints of bronze in there as well with like this weird brown bronze yeah that's what you want to call it this toe box is very nice uh quality control was all right i wouldn't say it's the greatest for these i know a couple of people got their pairs in with some little bit of a defect but for 110 bucks bro come on are you really complaining i'm saying 110 bucks but the resale value on these is a lot higher than that it's around going to like 350 400 right now this is made after the anime robots the gundam anime robots so that's where they get the inspiration from and that's why this toe box looks super sick i love when the nike sb switch it up on the toe boxes they did it with the sean clivers i have up there as well they did a snowflake you have your toe box outline in this brown color and then underneath that you also have a bronze color so nike sb usually tends to make double or triple layers on this part or this part right here just because it's a skateboarding shoe you know so this gets hit really bad when you skateboard and the back as well when you're doing tricks or just riding around you know everything gets worn down so these should expose a different color underneath as well whenever i wear them and things like that kind of like my like my lakers to chicago jordan ones medial side of the sneaker nothing going on no removable swoosh on here this one is just gold very nice touch though gives it a nice contrast in the box it brought this accessory as well this is actually some more stickers that you can put on here it is just a water transfer so it's kind of like those tattoos we used to use as kids and you just put these any logo that you want the name warning things like that and it also brings extra pair of swooshes so you have a bronze swoosh in there if you wanna make it match the shoe more, cause it, it'll really look nice with this bronze. It's like that bronze right there. We got nylon tongue going all the way up and then Nike SB Dunk High Pro on the tongue there. Looking spectacular. Ankle strap, this is unflappable. If that makes any sense, you guys can unlace that and just have it hanging if you guys want that look. Like I said, the swoosh removes and you get this effect which is pretty nice like i like the shoe how it looks like this uh the bronze one even looks better and you have your water transfer right here from default rxo dunk high warning so like i said you can literally rub this off and put another one on there or you could put it here or you can put it there wherever you want to do with it so we're going to turn around to the back side now and this is what looks a little bit awkward uh you can see like some blue i think there 
and the back of it nice shape everything checks out wonderfully you have this little somebody told me that this was used to tie your shoes like you bring the laces from up i don't know how true that is i called it a back tab in one of my videos and somebody commented and said that that's to make the laces hold stronger so shout out to him if he's right but if he's not <laughs> That's a L for me for taking his advice. Inside lining in this nice gray. And then you have your insole, Zoom Air Nike SB. And also, not only do you get extra accessories, you get extra color laces, man. Like this is, come on, bruh. This should be standard, bruh. Whoa, I don't know what this green is supposed to match with, but they added green laces as well. You have your navy laces that come attached to the black and you have a gold to match the swoosh and then you have a green to match I don't even know, bro. Maybe for Christmas. I don't know why they included this green one. Uh, there's nothing in the shoe that makes it green at all. All right, guys. So with all that being said, what do you guys rate these Nike SB Gundams? I'm off the top going to give them a 10 out of 10 because literally I paid 10 dollars. $10. I paid $110 for these. You know what I mean? So you're not going to get anything even remotely close to as good as this, man. Like. This is why I love Nike SBs. They go above and beyond on the quality, on the premium materials, on the accessories that it brings. Like, come on, man. No other sneaker company, part of a company. Because Nike SB is something different. Um, they release the shoes whenever they want. Nike, Nike gives the skate shops that permission to do so. Uh, so every skate shop handles everything a little bit differently. So you have to check on your local skate shops to see what are their rules and everything like that. Um, I've won a couple SBs from this place, uh, but a lot of them I got were from sneakers. Uh, so yeah, keep that in mind. But yeah, man, let me know what you guys think of this Nike SB Gundam Navy in the comment section down below. Do you guys think this, this is the SB of the year? Uh, literally just because the price and what you're getting with it is just incomparable. Like extra swooshes, you guys can double up the swoosh triple up if you guys want to count the velcro but you guys can do so many variations you guys can put all the tattoos and decals on here and just make it your own shoe you know and that's what nike sb is all about um so yeah i'm probably going to be wearing these for christmas i'm not sure yet uh still thinking of a fit to put together if you guys enjoyed this video i want to thank you guys so much for making it this far and thank you guys for liking and subscribing i appreciate you guys and i'll see you guys on the next one